All right, what's up, chicken man? Um, I like this car. It's a 1992 Corvette Mustang. I was going to plan to like change it up someday. They like, put a new stereo in it, new um, mud flappers on it, new uh, car and different kind of stuff. So I'm going to shut up my engine. So I'm going to start it up so we can hear it. Yep. Does it sound good? Hang on. All right, go ahead and start her up. Okay. See, there's four cylinders of fury sound like. NASCAR, tell me what we're doing today. Today we're going to take this old piece off and put it on the new, they like put it on this new fender on. That's not a fender, Rain. dude. Rain. Wing. All right, like, take this off, put this on. So we're going to put this one on. Put that off. We're going to put that one on? Yeah. I got Trash. it off. Trash. Where, see where do I want to put it at? Yeah, why not? That looks cool. Yep. Now we need to wire this up. No, I wouldn't worry about the wiring. Don't worry about the wiring. Just Right now we gotta figure out how to mount it. So we're gonna need some L brackets. We, we can angle it more like that. Yeah. We can angle it just like that. That'll be that's easy. We just adjust these things in the back. Yep. We need to. We need to mount it. it. Looks good. Looks good. You like it? Yep. All right. Pause the camera. Okay, so right now we're making mounting brackets, right NASCAR? Yep. Little mounting brackets, especially just L. Just using some flat stock with the outline around, make little L brackets that are going to go on the side of that uh, ghetto wing we're going to put on. So go ahead, Daytona. Got two so far, we're going to make two more. So here's how NASCAR is making these. Can't wait till we got our own shop because this is ridiculous. We gotta do this. Alright, now we're gonna cut it off. Okay, so now we're just gonna cut it off with our bandsaw. I know this isn't the proper way, but we're ghettoing this. It's okay.
So there we go, another L, one more to make. Go for it, a little higher. Hey Tona, how long is an inch? An inch like this? Move, I can't see. No, an inch is like that. An inch is from here to here to Tona. From that knuckle to that knuckle, that's an inch, okay? So mark, mark where you're going to put it with your fingers. And slide it down to there. Now, now cut it off. I want to do it straight, bro. There. Got it on there? Bend it over. Okay. So now we're going to drill holes in them, straight up and down. You don't have to push super hard. You're going to go two levels. The other side. This side. What do you think? Yes. Okay. Okay. Here. Put some holes in there. Okay, do the last one. Come on. So grab those, grab the drill, and let's go up to the car. All right, let's put this thing on. Is that where you want it? Yep. Okay. Here's how we're gonna do it. We're basically gonna mount our holes down in the trunk, like that, okay? Okay. I'm gonna do the first couple. Okay. So now when you line them up, bring that back up here. They're basically going to 
to set it down on here, Nathan. Let's see if we can put it in. Yeah, because you moved it, doofus. Look. Look where you're trying to line it up. You see? Come on, man. Use some brain cells. Katona. Where do the holes go, man? Right here. So line it up with the holes. It's not that hard. I am. Okay. Where's my other two? Where's my other screws? I'm missing one of these. Find it. These are actually pretty. That's pretty sturdy, actually. Your wing back up here. and I give you the whole K-member springs, everything off of a V8 box. Oh, I got it. Okay, well, make me an offer on it. All right, I'll do 75. Will you take the whole K-member? I really don't want to pull it apart. Yeah, I mean, you can bring it back if you want with the metal, but uh, it's just easier for me. I can, I can remove four bolts and call it good. Do it today. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll have one uh, that a full cool K member with uh, the front disc and everything. Actually, looks pretty dope. Hey Tim, this is uh, Wes. I got the Fox body parts.
Five bucks are good enough. Yeah. That doesn't look that bad. I mean, you broke the end off. We're gonna ditch. We're gonna drift stitch it back on. Yeah. Wait, look at it from this side. It's not that terrible. It's it's pretty ghetto fab. Well, I mean, the giant rust. Yeah. yeah. That that helps with the ghetto fab. Yes. But I mean, it's, it's, <laughs> it's kind of awesome. Yeah. It goes with it. You like the shirts? Is that what there? Those are gonna be the shop ones. I'm gonna buy two hundred dollars worth of patches and take a whole box of those shirts. I'm gonna take every single one of them in that box. And I'm just gonna iron on all the patches and I'm gonna have my shop shirts. <laughs> totally awesome. Yeah, let's keep them and use it. You come, you throw it on. It's too dirty, you know. It's too point. Go throw in the wash. Getting it on, Daytona? Yep. It's pretty good, actually. So what I've started doing. I've started <coughs> using this camera to just kind of film okay, yeah. what we do, like in a day-to-day -day sense. Yeah. Just to try and keep people more up to date. Yeah, dude, there's nothing wrong with that. I'm totally down with doing that. So I'm gonna I'm gonna start doing like vlog type videos, just like, hey, this is what we're doing today. This is what we did today. Yeah. Like, I mean. Today, you know, you got an actual video going, but then I can also film, like, this is what we did today that yeah. you didn't see. So. Yeah. No, that's... I've probably got enough for six or seven videos already. We'll just get them done. The footage isn't the hard part. It's hard editing. Part sitting down editing. <laughs> it's sitting down and so editing. when you said, you were like, oh, I was up to two, I was, I was up to two dropping a video. Because mm -hmm. I dropped a new video last night. I actually am digging this. It just, it just look, uh, it'll look good. It's very much just Daytona's though. I wish I, I wish we could, there was a way to five lug swap it. And I'd put those for a Oh, yes. Right? That would be great. I know. Oh, we need to find a bunch of 95 GTs. Parked cars. I'll just, and I, I don't care if it's a <clears throat> beat up 2.3, you only got a thousand bucks in. I'd totally put those on it. it well, would just, everything uh, needs five looks on it. It's got a, it, it's a, it'd be a ricer. I mean, it's a little ricer. It's, it's, it's awesome. We'll give it a, we'll do some body work on it, and we'll give it a, a satin paint job when we redo everything. Yeah, we're, we should just satin paint everything yeah, we're, that's yeah. matte black right now. I'm going <clears> to literally <throat> satin that entire car. Put yeah. bumpers, freaking wheels, everything. Yeah. You mean you don't like the mismatchedness? No, I don't. You, you're not going to roll up to the drag strip? How does that car make you feel, Caleb? Oh. He's talking about that one, by the way. Yeah. Grabber got one? Yeah. The monster in the barn? Oh, yeah. So nice. I don't know. Should we swap the Cobras onto the T-Burn down? What do you think? I don't know. Put the ten holes on that. You know, you know where the plates for the T-Bird are. Right on the Subaru. <laughs> Turbo four cylinder. <laughs> That's how we drove it. <laughs> yeah. They're going. Wait, where are they? I don't know. Yeah. Unless we can get off that. We got it out. We couldn't get it back in. Yeah. <clears throat>